everyone in, in this video I'll be talking about Ransom's criteria and um, Ransom's criteria is used in assessing the prognosis of acute pancreatitis um, you assess the patient on admission as well as within 48 hours and there is a mnemonic on that on for on admission it is gallo or legal and you're probably wondering how am i going to remember these totally unrelated words with pancreas and this is how i remember ransom sounds like a ransom and ransom is money that a kidnapper demands from you and um, obviously kidnapping is related with law and legal issues and jail don't kidnap people all right so um there are two criteria actually one is for goldstone pancreatitis and the other is for non goldstone pancreatitis um just um to brief you with all the um letters g stands for glucose a stands for age l stands for ldh e stands for enzyme or ast and w stands for wbcs or leukocytes and the reason i want you to remember both these words is because if you forget one thing from one word the other word is there to compensate for it like once i totally forgot what the l stand for and then um the other word kind of helped me out that maybe it's wbcs so yeah I need two mnemonics for the same thing. That's how bad my memory is. Um, yeah. So we have glucose, and in Goldstone pancreatitis, glucose is um, greater than two twenty milligram percent, and in non Goldstones, it's greater than two hundred milligram percent. I'm just gonna shift it in the frame. Um, A stands for age. And age um, in Goldstone pancreatitis, if it's greater than 70 years, and in non Goldstones, is less, it's greater than 55 years. The um, L stands for LDH, and in Goldstone pancreatitis, it's greater than 400. Um, this is how I remember L looks like a 4, all right, and in non Goldstone pancreatitis, it's um, 700. And if you flip around L, it looks like um, a 7. So that's how I remember the 700. Um, it's international units per liters. Um, the other A is for AST. And um, AST is greater than 250 international units per 100 milliliters. And the way I remember this is 2 has 2 strokes. And the number two also starts with the letter t so t and two and s looks like a five so ast 250 that's how i remember it's the same for non goldstone pancreatitis thank god and um w is for wbc's uh, for goldstone pancreatitis it's greater than eighteen thousand per cubic millimeter and um for non goldstones it's uh two thousand less 16,000 per cubic millimeters um, so this is how what the criteria looks like now we're going to talk about what do you assess within 48 hours of admission and the mnemonic for that is Calvin and Hobbes and if you don't know what Calvin and Hobbes is it's a comic on a kid and a tiger and it's hilarious um i just kind of think of the c of the criteria and that's how i remember calvin and calvin and hobbes just comes into my head so um yeah c is for calcium and again we have um the goldstone criteria and the non-goldstone criteria so um calcium if it's less than eight milligram percent uh, it's the same non goldstone criteria um it stands for hematocrit drop and um if it's greater than ten percent 
is the same for non goldstone um, criteria as well o stands for oxygen um pao2 and it's not there in the goldstone criteria it's there only in the non goldstone criteria and it's less than 60 mm of mercury and um not millimeters yeah um b is for bio and um beyond rise and um in goldstone pancreatitis it is um greater than 2 mg percent and um in non goldstone pancreatitis it's greater than 5 mg percent okay and now you have to remember these values because they're going to help us um remember the other values which will come um b the other b stands for base deficit and um i just carry forward the five which i wrote here out here so base deficit if it's greater than 5 ml equivalence per liter it is bad and it's in the goldstone pancreatitis and um out here the base deficit is 4 ml equivalence per liter and um the s stands for fluid sequestration and in non in goldstone pancreatitis it is i just carry forward the 4 so it's if it's greater than 4 liters and in non goldstones in non goldstone criteria it's greater than 6 liters when i first looked at all of these uh, values i noticed the non goldstone criteria the uh, all the numbers are even numbers say 2 4 6 8 and 10 but in non goldstone criteria the bun is actually 5 and you kind of write the two out here and then have that's how i carry forward the numbers um five out here and four out here so it's complicated but i hope that helps and um that's all um there's also a glasgow imri criteria for um pancreatitis um the mnemonic for that is pancreas but um i'll probably make a video on it later it will confuse you if you're not thorough with the pancreas criteria and um that is all i hope you had fun learning and stay awesome